welcome to another Cook With Me. Hey, if you guys like our Cook With Me videos, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. If you've never seen a Cook With Me video, give us a thumbs up anyway. Yeah, and yeah. go check out the playlist. Yes, go check it. Okay, we were just watching the Flautas video. I'm oh, obsessed. Man. I look like I was stung by bees. <laughs> like, I look so swollen, no? Uh... uh... <laughs> Danny can't say anything, but I totally look swollen. Like, you, 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 let's just say you can notice that you've lost quite a bit of weight. Yes, and but here's the thing. I do feel like I was inflamed a little bit. Like, I think I was eating, like, a lot of sugar uh -huh. and a lot of just crap that not only was I, like, gaining weight, I was, like, inflamed. Yep. Because I look like bee sting. <laughs> I look like bee sting. <laughs> all over I don't know it's it's kind of strange looking back it kind of is because you don't realize it when you're in it and then looking back you're like oh, oh dang. my goodness yeah because I'm down 12 pounds guys and dang pounds. looking no, don't do that. Don't good do that. I still got a lot of work to do. <laughs> I still got a lot of weight to lose I still want to lose at least another 12 pounds at least so we're still working hard it's feeling good to like be a little bit healthier and things like that. So yes, we don't deprive ourselves of the good stuff either. We both weighed ourselves this morning and we like broke our next level. We broke you into the. Cut that out. You broke into the. And I broke into the. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> and yeah, so we it are. Yeah, it feels totally good. Yeah, so it's nice. Anyways, so we are doing an easy, another easy cook with me, you guys. This is seriously so simple. It's literally four ingredients that's it and that's for the entree and the side so that's four ingredients for both of those things and it is amazing amazing all right so all we are literally going to do for the entree is we're gonna put some chicken in this pan and then we're gonna put some olive garden dressing on top of it and bake it that's it. The Olive Garden dressing is so good. So good, and it makes the chicken very flavorful. And I do something else after it's done baking to kind of get the flavor in like all the meat. So I'll show you guys what I do after that. Could so, you marinate it like overnight or no? You it's, could, yeah. that'd probably be really good. But my chicken's frozen, which it's okay to do it if it's frozen, no big deal. Um, you just have to bake it a little bit longer. Oh, by the way, coconut oil spray, bomb diggity, Trader Joe's. Whoa. Nice. Trader Joe's. So there you go. Check out that outfit Tina has oh, on. Oh, stop. Nice. Oh, this outfit. <laughs> All right, so we're putting the frozen chicken right in the pan. And I'm almost wondering if I should make two pans of this. And this is just the boneless, skinless chicken breast. Um, and I can't remember. Man, that's been a little bit. It might be Sam's Club, to be honest. This might be Sam. Really? Yeah. It might be Sam's, guys. I can't remember. Sorry. And aren't you, you guys? Know whatever chicken you want. And aren't you and guys like so excited for our next grocery haul? Like, that's coming up. Yes. That's coming up. I don't know when. Couple days. I think maybe Friday. I think I need another pan. Yeah. So actually, Friday, we're gonna do the grocery haul, which means it will come up Saturday. Saturday. So stay tuned it because be this is going to be totally the kids get their budget. So yes. sponsored by Suzanne Baker, one of our awesome viewers. Yep, and she wanted us to do it and we were like, heck yeah, we'll do it. It's yep. awesome. So, so that's coming up. Look for that on Saturday. That'll be fun. Yes. But I'm going to say it's going to be interesting taking all five kids to the store. We haven't had to do that in a while. Yes, which we might have to take two cars because... With all the groceries. With all the groceries. Yeah. yeah. That's true. I didn't think about that. So we'll have to figure that one out. Yeah. So we might go. Yeah, we can, we'll we figure that out. We might split it up. Split it up into the two, um, the two teams. Tina might go with the older two, the older two, and then I might go with the youngers. Yeah, we'll figure it out. We'll make it fun, and it's going to be cool because we do need um, groceries. All right, so I did two pans there. Let me wash my hands because that's raw meat. Okay, you guys, so we got all of the chicken in the pans. Um, this is a thinner chicken breast than, um, you know, like the regular thick one. So we're not going to have to bake this as long, which is kind of nice. And because they're frozen, it will add a little bit more like juice to it, which I'll show you what I'll do with that after. So we're going to just literally, you guys, pour this over the chicken. Boom. Oh. Look at that. So easy, you guys. And then we're going to do this pan. 
So for all this chicken, you literally only need one thing of Olive Garden dressing. And we got these at Sam's, they come in a two pack. So my kids love this chicken. Look how yum. And your husband. Well, yeah, and you. So That's good. That's a given. So, so delicious. Good. So flavorful, like the most flavorful chicken ever on the planet. Guys, that's it. Boom. That's it. You know what? I'm surprised Olive Garden doesn't have like something like this. They probably do have some. I'm With sure. their dressing? No, they probably put on their... I don't know. I yeah, haven't I seen know. it. But this is amazing. Damn. This is so easy. Like literally, this will be done in no time. That's it. We just put it in the oven and I'm going to say 400 for about 30 minutes. Since really? 30 minutes? Yeah. Okay. 25 to 30. We'll check it. But because it's frozen... I probably want to do it a little bit longer. And then um, while that's cooking, we'll show you guys how to make this is what we got from Costco. I don't know if you guys remember the Costco haul. Oh man, they nailed us with the samples. The samples got us on this because it was so good. So we are going to make this and see how it turns out. I'm going to make it with the... Um, chicken booyah. Chicken booyah, which I don't know how to say the real way. Booyan. Booyan. So, because you can cook this in chicken broth, we don't have any, so we're gonna flavor the water with the chicken bouillon, and... It's chicken bouillon. Chicken bouillon, baby. So, there you <laughs> go. So, let's put the chicken in real quick. Oh, and look! Oh, yes, Jen Bowles! Jen Bowles! Okay, I still have another one. It's lost in the laundry somewhere, <laughs> but I do have it. But look how cute these are. She made us these cute little hot pads, like, totally... Handmade. Like, how cute are those? Yeah, those are the surprises that we get when we go to the P.O. box. It's so cool. We love it because they're, like, made with love. Like, this, you know this took time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, thank you, Jen Bulls. I told you we have them. I just had to get them out of the laundry. There's still one in the laundry somewhere. I will find it. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyway. It's like a sock. Jen Bulls is amazing. So. Let me get a close-up of these. Look at those. That's so awesome. Let's get this chicken in the oven. Oh my gosh. All right, chicken going in, folks. Chicken going in. Bam. And then let me get the other pan. Okay. About 25 minutes, guys. That's Say that it. again. Say that again. Dinner will be then ready. Then dinner will be ready in about 25 minutes. So we'll let that cook up. And then while that's cooking, I'll probably wait 10 minutes and then cook the rice because the rice only takes 10 minutes. So, boom. Okay, so while the chicken's in the oven, we are cooking this. It's the rice ancient grains. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know, but it was good when it was in the samples. Why are you laughing at me? Because I just am. <laughs> Whatever. Look at all this. See? All oh, the wow. Look at all those grains. Yeah. Look, it's all right here, too. So I already put four cups of water with the chicken booyah in there. This stuff. Boom. So that's in here boiling. We are gonna add two cups of the rice. We're just gonna pour it right in, just like that. Bam. Boom shakalaka. And then it actually does call for butter. So boom, butter. There you go. Nice. And then you bring it to a rapid boil. And then we will simmer. What does so, that mean? You, you don't know what rapid means? No, but like how do you bring it to a rapid boil? The stove does it, babe. Isn't <laughs> no, that amazing? What's the difference between a regular boil and a rapid boil? How do you make it go rapid? Rapid is like... <laughs> I know, but how do you do it? Do you turn With on the, higher or what? Yeah, just a high heat, babe. <laughs> Takes a little bit of time and a little bit of high heat. Okay, so how do you do a regular boil? A regular boil, you just don't let it get to like a rapid boil. A regular boil <laughs> is a rapid boil. You are weird. No. Yes, you are weird. Oh, I just That is the weirdest comment I've ever heard. No, I am not no, weird. you are weird. No. <laughs> I'm so rapid and what is regular boil? <laughs> Goodness. They wrap it three times. Why? Just you realize how weird of a word no it is. Do it. No, we're spending too much rapid, time on this word. Rapid. No. Rapid. <laughs> you are weird, weird, weird. <laughs> Look, it's getting faster, oh, babe. Wow. It's a little more rapid now. You see what I'm saying? Rapid, you know? No. Yeah, look I at it. I thought it was like, like. Look at it. Rapid, rapid, rapid. All right, so there's a rapid boil. It's rapid boiling. <laughs> boiling rapidly. Okay, and then we're gonna put the lid on, turn the heat down to low, and let it simmer. Adios, rapid boil. <laughs> Shush it. Okay. Okay, the chicken's ready to come out. 
Where look, are the other ones? Look are at those the chicken. Ooh. So good, guys. I love your matching. <laughs> I know. Oh, Leave me alone. I'm using gin. Oh, awesome. Those are so cool. Leave matchers. Me alone. I don't care. Matchers. I don't care, baby. At least my hands aren't getting burnt. It's doing what it's supposed to do. Boom. And then I'm just putting them on Jen's hot pads from the counter. Maybe. Dang it. Oh, that's sizzling. Oh. Okay, so once I take it out, I've got this pan here heated up. Hold on. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it straight from the oven into this pan. Boom, okay? You see what I'm doing here? And that's heated, right? Is that rapidly heating? Mm, rapidly, you know what? <laughs> you get a rapid fire? Rapid fire you. <laughs> so, and then when it's in here, I'm just gonna take whoa, 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 getting whoa. a little too close for comfort right you there. You like it, don't pretend. I do. Okay, so you're just gonna kind of cut it up in here. And boom. Shaka, it off. laka. Cut it all up, boom, boom, boom. Nice. Yeah. I know, I look weird when I cut, I'm left-handed. Unless that, what was it? What did someone oh, say? Oh man, you guys. Oh man, it let's was, go. I was actually. Let's do this. Let's go. No, I was, Negative comment. Okay. I was laughing <laughs> so hard. This person, whoever this person was, oh. was going crazy. Like they must have been up real late at night and just no, been like. They were going crazy. They left like maybe six, seven comments on different videos. On and some of the same videos <laughs> about me being left-handed and saying how like I'm gonna die nine years earlier than a right-handed person. How how if I went to school when they went to school, I would have been smacked in the hand with a ruler. They called me cat handed, whatever that means. Oh, I was rolling on the ground. I was like, man, this Did person Did you screenshot it? I did, I think. Oh yeah. I think I did. Because I, I was like dying. I had to show Danny. I was like, oh man. This person has issues with left-handed people. So they're like, oh. you look like you're gonna cut your hand off with that left-handed skills. I like how you do that voice. Oh, you know what else they said? What? Why don't you just adapt to the rest of the world? Oh, oh man. <laughs> I was seriously dying. You actually have when you cut with your scissors because you can cut with right-handed scissors. That's true, I did, that's true. So I just thought that was hilarious. What some people's issues are are so funny to me. So I'm just cutting this, gonna continue to cut this and um, kind of brown it a little bit. Does that look good, dude? Mm -hmm. How does it smell, yeah. Huh? Yeah, the kids love this, guys. This is a hit with the kids. So yeah, as soon as I get this all cut. Oh, the kebabs, yeah. Should, yeah, I might do a, a cook with me, even though we did it in a vlog, I might do a cook with me with the the kebabs with the hummus and basmati rice. Yeah. That was good. That was really, that was a good meal. Actually, a really good meal. So we're almost got this all cut in here with my left hand. <laughs> I was dying, guys. That was just so funny. If you're left-handed, drop below in the comments. I know, you guys. If you're left-handed, you you automatically notice other left-handers. Cause and I've been married to Tina for some time now, and I always sit on the wrong side of her. Well, that's the other comment they made. They <laughs> said, um, "You always sit next to right-handers, and, and you annoy the heck out of oh. us <laughs> because oh. your elbows like bump oh, there." Oh man! Oh, I was laughing. Especially when you're riding, mom. It's annoying. It is. Uh. I know. <laughs> Too bad I'm gonna die nine years earlier. Yeah, but when you when Tina writes on like a chalkboard or a dry erase oh, board, she erases what she's writing. As you write, because you know you write like this kind of, and so you're erasing it as you're writing it. So whatever. I like being left-handed. I don't care. I love that you're left-handed. I love it. I have Ashlyn's left-handed and Elijah's also left-handed, and I love that I have kids that are left-handed. Okay, so this is all chopped up. Okay, so watch this. Watch this smooth move, okay? Boom, here we go. Oh, here it goes. Delicious. Ready? So. What do you call this? Olive Garden chicken. How did you come up with this? I just tried it. Really? Yeah, I was like, like no one showed you? Like, no, because it's like one of those things like, what can I marinate chicken with? Dressing. I've done it with Italian dressing. 
like regular Italian dressing. So I was like, oh, I guess might as well use the the um, Olive Garden. Olive Garden one. So I'm just gonna let it sit here, guys, and just totally soak all that. Look at that amazingness. That looks Look so at that. good. So we're gonna let that soak in, like get in between all the chicken, and that will be. How long do you put that on day. for? How long do you do that for? Um, probably till the rice is ready, like maybe five, maybe ten minutes. Really? Yeah. And that's on like medium high or what? Yeah, it's like on medium heat right now. Okay, just want to let our viewers yeah, know. Yeah, thanks, babe. Thanks yeah. for looking out. Appreciate that. What do you do with this? Do you drink it? Sure. If you like want you to. do the um, the cucumber juice with salt? Do not drink it. Oh, I would not recommend that. Oh, uh, is that you a know? challenge? That's a challenge. I, you know what you could do though is pour it over your rice. That would be good. Oh yeah, actually that would be. Yeah. Good. So good. even the stuff that's left over in here, you can pour over your rice. That's too. good. That's good. That's good. Gives it flavor. So, anyways, we're gonna wait for the rice to finish up, and then the chicken's pretty much ready to go, and then we're gonna taste it for you. Okay, you guys, the rice is all done. This is what it looks like. Check her out. Bam. So good. No joke. I've never actually made it, so we'll see if I made it okay. I don't know. It seems pretty uh, self-explanatory. That was hot. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to dish it up here real quick. This will be Daniel's plate. Daniel Phillips. Here you go. Who is that? It's Daniel Phillips. <laughs> that is not a me. That is totally you. Yeah. <laughs> we got some chicken here. So you could put the chicken on the side or on top of your rice, whatever you prefer, guys. Yeah, I've never tried you. this rice. Like I've tried it at at uh, Costco, Just but I've never sample. tried it with the chicken, so I don't want to put it on top yet until I know. And I might even bust out some um, hummus. some hummus. I just love hummus. Yeah, dress it up however you guys want. Obviously, get creative. This is just how we do it. We got our limes. With no lime, I mean, what? <laughs> Our cucumbers with no lime. Our cucumbers with no lime because we're out, but we got cucumbers, salt, chicken, rice. That's it, that's dinner tonight, guys. That is dinner. Do you wanna try it? And we, yeah, I'll definitely try it. And we like when everybody comments, um, we love the comments when they're like, oh, we do the same thing, but we add this, or we we, yeah. we love it, but what do you, you know, maybe try this. We, we love that. Because we weren't, like, you guys know, we are not professional cooks. We are far from it. So we always talk about, Danny and I always talk about how we learn so much from you guys. Because you guys yes. come on, oh, we do this with our chicken, or we do that, or we do this, or we do that. I love it because not only are we getting more ideas, but anyone reading through the comments are getting ideas from you guys. And you guys are awesome. Like... Legit. You guys, a lot yes. of you know what you're talking about. You want legit style cooking? Where do we go? You want legit style cooking? You go to Noreen's Kitchen because <laughs> yeah. she is amazing. The and I'm also going to throw out there, she's in her apron because she is another one who... Kimmy. Yeah, Kimmy from She's in Her Apron. She is awesome with the cooking stuff too. So go check out both of their channels. We'll link them below. Let them know we sent you guys. They are They like, measure... They measure. No, they just know. Yeah, they they, just... they measure and they um, they know what to call all of the kitchen utensils. They know the names. And they can make homemade bread, guys. Oh. I can't do that. <laughs> so if you want to make homemade bread, which I still want to do that, yes. Maureen has like basically is trying to motivate me to <laughs> make some homemade bread. I will do it eventually, but go check out their channels because they are legit. If you guys like our cooking. Um, stuff then you'll definitely like definitely. their channels because they're all about that and different things so go to their channel check them out let them know we sent you and Danny's gonna try this right now Boom. okay all right so here we go what should I try first I don't know go this right is now. hard say first uh, rice chicken <laughs> rice chicken go Calm you're not gonna go oh, stop Five, four, three, <laughs> two, one, go all you're, right okay chicken it is <laughs> you're such a dork <laughs> oh man no like right mm -hmm. The most flavorful chicken you'll ever have in your life. It's so delicious, and the chicken is just tender. It's just, this is good. It's Bombay. Let's try this rice and see what's up with it. Let's do that. That's what it looks like. Cooked in the chicken booyah. Hot. Ooh, hot. Mm. Oh, good? Yeah. Oh, good. I've never made it before. That's good news, guys. You know, I don't know if this is good or bad. It tastes delicious. Uh-huh. But it, have you had rice a -roni? Yes, I love rice a -roni. Yeah, but it got like, I don't know. Kind of a rice a taste? Yeah. Probably because of the chicken booyah. 
oh, maybe. I don't yeah. Know. But it's kind of like because otherwise it doesn't have flavor in it. Yeah, it's no. Honestly, the the flavor on the rice is very delicious. Yay! Very, very delicious. Like, I like basmati, and then like just regular white rice. Like this is, this is up there with the basmati. Ooh! Like this. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. <laughs> this is up there with it. Like regular white rice with butter. Mm, it, it would go well with this. But yeah. This rice is That's really, legit. Really, it's really good. With the yeah. chicken? I really feel like the kids are gonna like this. Yay! Yes. Awesome. And cucumbers, I'm I'm okay with. Yeah, he's not a huge fan. But I like it. It's fine. Um, one out of ten rating. I'm gonna go ten. This. Is oh no, you didn't. <laughs> yes. I don't know. Yes, I did. <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> all right, guys, you heard it from Danny himself. And for all of you commenting, rice, rice, rice. Sorry, I already ate the chicken. <laughs> yeah, so. no one's commenting. They are they're on to your games. <laughs> yeah. Man, All right. This is so good. You know who you gotta get. You gotta see. Let Ethan try it. Let's let. Ethan okay. Try it real okay. Quick. Here comes Ethan. Hold hold on. Yeah. Here we go. Mm, no, good. <laughs> the drop of the knees. That's you, like. And, and he's never had this rice. Nope. Try that rice. Over the over chicken the though. Over good. Mhm. Mm yeah. Bombay. Sure. <laughs> Both together. That's dad's dinner, so <laughs> we'll make you your good? own plate. We're going to go sit at the table and eat. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, it's a hit, guys. You heard it. It's all for yourself. Have you even tried it? No, I've been like dipping in <laughs> it and eating it. It's so good. Yeah. No, I kid you not, you guys, the most flavorful chicken you probably will ever have. Go try it out. Let us know what you think. Super easy. What, you want me to try it? Um, what about the rice? Have you tried oh, it? I haven't tried the rice. Yeah. Let me try the rice. That's good. That is good. Yeah. Mm. Very good. Chicken booyah. That's the way to go. Yeah. Okay. So you guys, go try it. Let us know if you like it. Super easy, super quick. Love it, love it, love it. So good. Probably one of my favorite meals that we have. So go try this out. Like I said, let us know what you think. And also remember, we don't only do cook with me's. We do haul. We do grocery hauls. We do vlogs. We do challenges. We do... Sunday sit down. We're going to have a real cool Sunday sit down coming up. Yes. We got a good idea yes. for it. So you guys stay tuned for that. Um, if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We are well on our way to 20,000 20, subscribers, you guys. Holy cow. Mind blown. I think we've been doing it for a year now. Almost. Almost a year. Not quite. Maybe we could get 20,000 by our year mark. By July 12th. By July 12th. I don't know. Help us out, guys. Let us know. I mean, don't let us know. Just go hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell and... Share it with your friends on all your of friends. your social media. Yes, that would be awesome. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. We really appreciate it. Thanks for joining us with this Cook With Me. We will see you guys tomorrow. Do what you do. Know that all I think about is you Say the things you say I don't know how you make me feel this way